from the garden in here. As for your gardening forecast here this morning to kind of give you an idea of what we're tracking over the next couple of days. So overall conditions here indicated by the flowers up top here. So today not bad, but we are tracking rain moving in Wednesday, Thursday. So watering forecast today probably throw some water on there tomorrow and Thursday. Nah, I don't think you'll need to just because of the rain moving in maybe Friday, Saturday, depending on how quick that ground dries out. Quite a variety of temperatures uh, here at the station. We're actually about 36 degrees, 32 at the airport, 34 right now in the capital. A couple of light showers in northeastern Montana. Today we will peak out at 63 degrees in Great Falls, 66 in the capital, a couple of low 60s throughout the eastern plains. Mostly clear skies and pretty mild tonight. We'll see about 37 in Great Falls, 39 in the capital, mid 30s throughout the eastern plains. Tomorrow, though, we are tracking the possibility of a couple little isolated showers and thunderstorms. Better chance, though, of heavier rain as the afternoon plays out. So tomorrow we'll start to see some building clouds over the mountains, likely around the noon hour. Then tomorrow afternoon, some rain and or snow in the mountains, not out of the question right now. It looks like about four to six thousand feet and above. Now, the take home message is we have a lot of moisture to work with with this incoming system. So areas that do see snow, We'll see pretty substantial accumulation, six to eight inches in the mountains. But again, that's about 6,000 feet and above with just periods of heavy rain in uh, central Montana. That's going to take us into Wednesday evening and the first part of Thursday as well as that batch of moisture tracks through the state. Not too bad tomorrow, though, before that system moves in. 67 in Great Falls, 64 in the capital, 70s throughout the plains. And on Thursday, we'll continue to see some isolated showers move throughout the area, tapering off, though, as the day plays out. And a cooler day on tap as well. We'll see temperatures kind of fall a little bit, mid-50s. That's going to put us quite a bit below average for the season. Uh, 56 in the capital, a couple of lingering 60s, 60 degrees in Hayes, 65 then in Glasgow. Over the next seven days, here's how things will play out. Again, 63, mostly sunny. Tomorrow will start out pretty mild, but then again, that system's going to move in, kicking off widespread rain heavy at times and a couple of lingering showers on Thursday. Right now, it looks like that system's going to taper off, though, on Friday. Starting to let us warm up a little bit, but with those showers moving throughout the area, the remainder of the week and weekend is going to be a little bit cooler. Shannon?